Le Flair. Le Flair. It's him. What up, YouTube? It's the Top G. And if you're not subscribed to the Laugh Flair Lounge, then you better tap in now. Now we can settle this like you got some class, so we can get into some gangster shit. Hey, Chris. I don't want no issues, bro. I don't want no smoke. I don't want fights. I don't want to do nothing, bro. Who wants smoke with me? Who wants smoke with me? Who wants smoke with me? Who wants smoke with C? Who wants want smoke with me? Who wants? Okay, let's get down to the facts. Pussy, I'm dripping red. Don't let this RB shit fool you, niggas. Get ripped to shreds. Quavo talking like he does, nigga. You a bitch with dread. Can't wait to see the day that you back up all of that shit you said. What's all this ball shit you talking? You ain't no huncho, nigga. You the weakest link out of your click. Let's give it a hundo, nigga. You fuck my ex, ho. That's cool. I don't give no fuck, little nigga. Cause I fucked your ex when you was still with a bitch. I'm up, little nigga. They say revenge is sweet. Now think about that shit. Don't let that lie go over your head. I might just sing about that shit. I had a feeling about that dick. There's something sweet about that shit. I got some tea about that. Had a feeling off that dick. Something sweet about that bitch. I got some tea up off that uh, with tea. Alright. <clears throat> this is what we doing, I guess. I guess at this point, see, I'm gonna be honest with y'all, man. Like, I come from the old school, goddamn. Chris Brown, year older than me. Chris Brown, uh Chris Brown. While, while this is a, a, a nicely crafted diss track so far, this is a nicely crafted diss track. I'm not taking nothing away from Chris Brown. You still a tender dick nigga. You really having a beef by yourself. I'm just being honest with you. Like, this is a beef by yourself. Great diss track, great skills. You probably can out rap Quavo. Like, I... I really don't expect Quavo to say anything after this, but you say, okay, you fuck sweetie, man. Hey, listen, man. I'm gonna tell you this. You fuck you tell me you fuck my ex while I was while I was with her or whatever it was. Congratulations, nigga. I don't I'm not with her no more. I do not care. <laughs> I do not care. What you Chris want him to pick up the phone and text Sweetie like, you seriously? Serious, bro? Hey, man, check this out, man. There's two things in life I ain't never seen before. That's a UFO and a hoe that couldn't go. That's it, but I ain't gonna speak about that shit. Whoa. I ain't playing chess with a checker player. I'm a ticket bomb on a detonator. I shit on niggas, I'm a defecator. I put a Migo on a ventilator. Stop talking about beating girls. You was beating bitches on the elevator. We seen the taste, that's devastating. You Chris, shut your lying ass. <laughs> They was not, they, he was not fighting no bitch on the elevator, man. They were tussling about that goddamn PlayStation, man. They were tussling about that PlayStation. Cut it out. Now, we seen what you done did. We seen your damage. You the only nigga with restraining orders. You doing bad. You a bitch in your music trash. Fashion week, they set me next to your lame ass. I was truly mad. All I kept thinking about was breaking your face, but I gave you a pass. You lucky I ain't want to fuck the money up, boy. I would have broke you in half. I can see that. See that? I think if they got the hooking, they got the fighting. I think Chris Brown got down run that fade. And I think that he probably win. I think he definitely can uh beat on Quavo. Quit trying to be tough, you ain't like that. Why you keep showing off? Quit talk about drugs. You the only pack that I've been smoking on. I just hit my plug, told him come back, I'ma need more than one. Your last album was a weed trade. That's some bullshit that we roll up on. You know what's on, put you to bed. Night night, that's suit of fed. Show me that I'm tender, bitch. Time to prove what you just said. RIP take off, he the only real one that got true respect. Crazy how when he died, everybody really wished it was you instead. Oh, shit. You tripping, Chris, don't Hey man. This rap. This is rap. So yeah, this is what we expect to hear in a disc. But one thing I will say, one thing I will say that I have to ask. Really this deep? Is it really this deep though? Like that's just my question. I have Say that, don't lose your head. You didn't turn a big bad wolf on these fuck niggas, never knew revenge. This what happens when a fuck nigga push a real nigga out to the edge. This what happens when a dumb nigga get fame and it get to his head. You gon' kiss this ring, nigga. Big fuck you from my middle finger. I tattoo my trigger finger. Bring real beat to your dinner table. My mental state ain't never stable. I know this shit gon' sting, nigga. I ran your ass.
pass through the ring, a nigga, you just got body by a singer, nigga. Bitch. Who wanna smoke with me? 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 Who wanna All right, so <clears throat> I guess my overall reaction to this is this is a greatly, uh, a really good crafted diss track. Chris, you did your thing. Salute. Um, I just look at this whole situation, though, like if this wasn't Chris Brown, if this was somebody else, we would all be looking at this situation like, bruh, you're overly simping. Because this is what I look at it like. You Chris Brown. We know that you're bigger than Quavo. We know you're a living legend. Both of y'all are. But we know that Chris Brown is a certain in a certain stratosphere above Quavo, right? But obviously, and you saying you got sweet revenge. You fuck sweetie. Uh, I fucked your ex. Ah, da, 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 right? Which is a whole nother weird shit. Like, niggas is... Niggas is like pillow talking on record. That's another thing I don't like really like. But my whole situation, the whole thing is this. Quavo got some real estate in your head. Quavo has some real estate in your head. Quavo ain't said shit to make you this mad. Quavo was minding his business. You seen him at Fashion Week. You didn't get to touch him for whatever reason. And now. You just, like, in your own head, you just said your mental, your, your, your stable ain't right. You then created a, 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 a issue that really wasn't even, though it was a dead issue. It's years and years old. I don't respect it. I'm just being honest with you. And I know, I know, I know Quavo mind state. The only reason I'm saying I know his mind state, man, I, I, we, we, we grew up in the same community. We went to school together. I could tell you what these niggas used to do. These niggas used to do nothing but play basketball at the park, break into niggas' houses, and fuck each other's bitches. That's what them niggas come from, fucking each other's bitches, fucking each other's girlfriends, shit like that. I can guarantee you that nigga's not sitting up in no studio texting sweetie phone mad that you fucked her. That's just the truth. I might be a little biased too. I might be a little biased. I'm just telling y'all the truth. But whether it was, Quay, if, it, if this was Quavo doing what Chris Brown's doing, if he did that to Chris Brown, or like I said, the way that Chris Brown's doing the Quavo, even if, if we flip flop it, I would still say this is the simp off Olympic and this ain't no P shit. But I do think that the diss was, was great. And I do not think Quavo is capable of rapping like that. Um, the don't beat her up line was cool. I said you was. I said he was kind of up from that. Uh, but I don't think he could compete with this. I don't. I don't even suggest that you respond. I just keep on going about my day. Maybe you can troll like Rick Ross or something. That's just what I say to do. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't. I really wouldn't pay this no attention because only one of them coming off like a scent. Like you really don't. Like if you really don't honestly care about this shit, you see where he's trying to take it. He's trying to take it personal. He trying to. He want to fight you. He want to do all that. Like, I don't know, maybe, you know what I'm saying? Just let the shit go. Let Chris do whatever he do up in that house. You know what I mean? And keep it moving, man. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this situation, man. What do y'all think about Weakest Link? Do y'all think that Chris Brown is simping? And do y'all think that he's going to find Quavo and fuck him up? Y'all let me know what y'all think down below, man. Like, share, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell. And we out, baby. Boom.